Hello students, in uh, today's class we are going to talk about Markovnikov Road. When the addition of hydrogen halide to an asymmetric alkene like this, for example, H plus and Br minus hydrogen bromide used to be added with the propene. According to the Markovnikov's rule, Markovnikov addition, uh, you must know that when the addition of HBr, hydrogen plus goes to the carbon having lesser number of alkyl groups or alkyl substituents and Br minus goes to the carbon having more or greater number of alkyl substituents or groups. Why? The main reason to get the more stable secondary carbocation as intermediate. Rather than primary, we should get secondary carbocation. That would be the most stable carbocation. When that is possible, only by following this Markovnik of addition. According to this, you just see the propene. There is a sigma bond and pi bond. The pi bond is broken and the electrons are given to this hydrogen plus. It means the hydrogen plus is added with the carbon having lesser number of alkyl groups and Br goes to the carbon having more number of alkyl groups. It has got one alkyl group. So if you add like this, so this is our major product. The Br can be substituted here and CH3. The compound's name will be 2-bromopropane. It is also called as isopropyl bromide. So here this is an addition called Marconic of addition. It follows the ionic mechanism. And this is further explained as follows. How two type of carbocations are formed. We just recall the formula for propene what we were mentioned earlier. CH3, CH, double bond, CH2, to that we are adding HBr, H plus and Br minus. There are two chances. The chance one, the pi electrons are given to this hydrogen, which means this hydrogen plus is added to this particular carbon atom. If you add like that, you can have CH3, CH2, CH2 plus. This is the carbocation of time. Primary carbocation. One other chance. Just observe the second chance. This is the other chance. The pi electrons are now given to this same hydrogen. Now this carbon atom would be bonded with the hydrogen. So we can have CH3, CH, CH3 plus. So this is known as secondary carbocation. If you compare the carbocation, tertiary, secondary and primary, this is the order of stability of carbocation. So in this particular case, the most stable secondary carbocation is obtained only by following this rule. 
Marconi curve group. So that's the reason why 2 bromopropane is the major product. This is the major product. And this one is minor product. When the addition of alkene or when the addition of hydrogen bromide to alkene, we are getting 2 bromopropane as a major product rather than 1 bromopropane. This is based on the Marconi curve rule. Is it clear? Very, very simple. In order to get the most stable carbocation, secondary carbocation is more stable. To get that, the rule is to be followed. The name of the rule is Marconi curve rule. Okay.